Okay, guys. So, for those of you who like to leave your bobbin tail really long when you put it back in your machine, this is what's going to happen. So, that's why when it tells you in the software to shorten and cut it once you put the bobbin in to two to three inches, it prevents this from building up in the back of your machine because now I'm going to have to trim and cut it out. I'll show you. All of these threads back here, this is all white and it's all bobbin thread. And this is from leaving the bobbin tail too long. So I'm going to get all this trimmed up and cleaned out of this machine. Stop this build up. All right, have a good day. What do you want to be careful of when you're doing this is you don't want to dig into this black. Oh wait, sorry, there we go. Dig into this black right here. That is the seal of a ball bearing holding everything in place. So you don't want to dig in and damage that, which will allow air and um, into your ball bearings which is sealed so be very careful of that have a great day